Hello everybody, Average Gamer here, and welcome to another Supreme Ruler, uh, well, we'll say series. Um, in this one, we're actually going to be playing as Ontario in the 2020 Shattered World scenario. So we're going to bring it up here, uh, actually no, that's, uh, there we go, ownership. So you can see all the provinces of, of Canada here have been broken up. Um, all the states within the U.S. have been broken up. Mexico is pretty much proper. Um, South America is pretty much still proper. Um, the UN controls a significant amount of the islands in the Caribbean and around the world. I think they even care, control, yeah, a majority of them, um, yeah, around the world. Uh, Hawaii's on its own. China's broken up into one, two, three, four, five different countries. Vietnam is completely whole. Russia's broken up into one, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Eight, eight territories um, in Europe. Spain's in broken up into th into two. France is broken into two. Germany's in three country in three territories. Uh, England is broken up into three as well. Um, that's all pretty much accurate. Uh, Middle East is pretty accurate, and yeah, and Africa is pretty accurate as well. So yeah, um, world's pretty pretty broken up. We're playing as Ontario, uh, because well, that's where I'm from. I'm from Ontario. Uh, more in particular, I am from Brantford. Right here, boom. That's right. I've uh, Ballywood Studios. Right here is in Ancaster. It's about uh, thirty minutes away. Uh, it's actually how I found out where they were actually from was one of the, uh, I think it was Supreme Ruler 2020, when they you could just play as North America in the Shattered World scenario. Um, or was it, no, 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 sorry, it was uh, Supreme Ruler Global Crisis uh, was the one I played where I realized where they were. Uh, but anyways, we're going to look at our resources here. So first off, our agriculture is really good. We're going to obviously lock anyone out of that. Rubber is really, really bad. We're going to lock that. Timber is really good. We're going to lock that. Oil production is really bad. Um, we should have some access to oil down here, which we'll have to go go to soon. Coal, I believe we have access to coal up here in the north. Yeah. The only thing we don't have access to, I think, is we have oil down in the south there. Is... Um, is rubber. So it's just a matter of getting things getting things in order. So it might take us a little while to get things in order. Uh, metal, we're pretty low on metal. Uh, nuclear stuff, we're, we're low, but we have a lot of nuclear power, power plants, as you can see. So our plan here is to kind of get our, our resources in place. Get all that stuff good to go. So first thing I want to do is I want to build at least one more oil right there um food is fine rubber uh, i want to build a rubber synthetic plant apparently i can't build one okay uh timber we're fine for now oil we're building coal i want to build just one coal mine somewhere in the north here uh, somewhere I was hoping we already had something else, but we don't. So I'm going to build it right there. Metal, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm actually going to build it right there. Subbury? Yeah, Subbury. Should be the copper mine. Uranium, same thing. We're going to build just one uranium mine. I'm going to build it right there. Power, we're not going to do anything. Consumer goods, we're not doing anything. Industrial goods, nothing. And military goods, we're not going to do anything. Uh, we are going to lock, obviously, our minister out of the majority of this stuff. Uh, economically, we're pretty good. Uh, but we do owe a lot of money when it comes to debt. So one of the things we want to do is pay off a lot of that. Uh, I'm going to tell... Oh, actually, I want you to repair stuff. Uh, we're going to up taxes to 
I'm going to cut overall spending, though, down a little bit, down to 300 million, just for now, just so we can get a bigger, bigger difference. Just so we can kind of get things in uh, in control a little bit here. Pay off all our resources. We have three things that we can research. So obviously we're going to go into society research here. Uh, what will give me... These things use up the money. Okay, so obviously we're going to do recycling. The Trump ideology. Uh, urban renewal. Infrastructure rating up and enforcement is up. But that doesn't give me... Coal classification. That gives us increased... Uh, well, that's modern coal classification. Man on the moon. Oh, that'd be interesting, but we can't afford that. Uh, clean coal. Overall, we get no effects there. Upgraded coal generation. There we go. Coal production up. And yeah, then we're going to do... You know what? Then we're going to do upgraded uh, patrol... Uh, Petroleum generation and coal generation get more uh, more resources. There we go. Then we're gonna put ourselves on fast. We're gonna look to see just how badly we're gonna be hurting here in a second. Oh, uh, unit construction. Oh, actually, I'm gonna turn that off momentarily. I just remembered. I want to tell you, hey. Uh, none for everything there. Lock you out of stuff that. And we're good there, okay. Um, our finance minister, I am going to give him a couple, a couple things. Um, want him to generally improve our GDP in the back end while I'm doing stuff. So he'll do little things that he can touch, but he'll, he'll be rather locked out. Um, I want you to uh, go for influence. Um, I want you to, and, and I want you to go for trade relations. Uh, espionage. Get rid of all that. I really don't need it right now. Um, our minister. I locked him out of a lot of stuff, so there's not really much he can do. Um, no, you're locked out of that. that yeah, you're pretty much locked out of all that stuff. There's nothing you can do there. You, I'm locking you at all that. You... Uh, increase reserve personnel, please. All right, and we're good to go. Well, let's watch to see how our money goes here. And we'll be able to play it from there. Okay, it's going up. Okay, good. Get some trade offers. Uh, you want to buy consumer goods from us? Um, yeah, I'll do that. It's East Germany, okay. More worried about getting our stuff built than anything at this point. Uh, I'm going to say, hey, uh, don't show me this anymore. You want to buy consumer goods as well. Okay. Making a little bit of money when it comes to trade, which is pretty good. Oh, that reminds me. We've got to check our prices for our commodities as well. Uh, you want to do a time 60 for just a simple 239 tons. Okay. Um, we want to export. But yeah, right now the cost is not great. Um, I only want you to export 95% because I want our 90%. Later on, we'll increase that to 95. You, um, I want you to do nothing here. We need to keep our own rubber. There we go. Our own rubber production going. Um, there. Acaster is getting some synthetic rubber. That should put us to roughly around the 7... 700 we need. Um, wood. Let's try to break even. And we're willing to sell 95% because we have so much. Oil. Um, sell 95%. Just a little under the market. And we'll do 1.1 million barrels at a time. 
coal. Don't sell any of it. Metal. Same deal, yo. Uranium. Yep, yeah, same deal. Power. Yep, yeah, sell as much as you can. Consumer goods, we'll sell as much as we can, which is about 80%. We're going to sell just with a small little markup. Industrial goods. I only want you to sell 80% because we're doing a lot of build. Actually, you know what? We're going to say 70 because we're going to be doing a lot of building. So and then military, um, I don't want you to sell anything, actually. No. Uh, uh, the reason why I don't want to sell any military goods is because there's probably going to be some military buildup and some conflicts early on. Because, I mean, one of our goals is to unify all of Canada. So, I'm not too worried about the states. I might take the East Coast here. Maybe take Connecticut, Rhode Island, Massachusetts, maybe New Hampshire, maybe Vermont, Maine, and New York. And maybe even these two. Take uh, Pennsylvania here and New Jersey. Um, you know, what? I'm gonna take that lump sum of uh, of metal ore. It's because we need it, and I'm also gonna sell off that 14 tons of consumer goods. Lump sums are good right now. Uh, times 30, times seven. No, thank you. And we still don't have enough money to even pay off one of our loans yet. That just tells you right there how big our loans are. Um, yeah, I'll buy some lump sum of rubber. No, Moscow, I'm not going to make a trade deal with you right now. Um, I have Diplomatic Merchant Marine off, which means I could sell units anywhere in the world that I want, which is a possibility actually right now. Early on, one thing you can do is build troops and sell them internationally. Um, costs 32 days and it costs 150 million. So right now it costs 150 million for me to sell a Kodiak Lav 3. Uh, some coyotes are in here, yeah. Um, if I were to sell one to say, oh, I can see my goods, lump sum rubber. I'll do that and get rid of that. Um... So right now, everybody's on good terms with everybody except for Moscow, because I said no to them for that one trade deal. And Eastern Germany as well. Um, if I were to supply West Germany with some units here, I can offer 200 million for one of these things. So I'll make 50 million per lav three that I make. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to look to see just how much it's going to cost me to build one of these things. It's going to cost me 929 tons. Okay. Production on and just build two of them. And that should come out of my military goods. And it should now pop up and say 18. Oh, 57. Okay. That must have gone up. Industrial goods. Okay. Uh, no, I'm good. Thank you. Let's close that off. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to sell like two military units here, two military units there. And basically just kind of go around and, and, and make a little extra cash on the side here. Uh, I'm not doing a times 30 deal for for that uh speaking of deals though 50 days whoa rubber you want to do consumer goods seven times that's 14 ah uh, it's 14 million tons and i only make a million tons or one yeah i only make 1000 tons a day so i would start falling backwards if i did this deal 
this times seven deal. Um, I'll buy lump sum or rubber. I can do this one in the short term. But I wouldn't, this would not be a good deal to go through. They're also requesting to pay basically half the cost of the consumer goods. Um, I'm going to agree to this only because... Actually, what? No, I'm going to say no to that, actually. It's not a good idea for us to cut ourselves short this early on. Now, one of the things about this game, too, is early on, you really will start to make your uh, your trade changes. So as you start trading with people and turning them down, you'll notice already uh, a lot of the southwestern U.S. and the southern U.S. really don't like us. Um, from A, who we're trading with, and B, declining them trades. Um, if we say no, we don't want to give you something, it's probably because they need it real bad and now they're mad at us because they have some problems. And it's not our fault that they, you know, like, for example, oh, is it Indiana here? No, not Indiana. Oh, it is? Yeah, Illinois. It's probably having some problems with a few areas when it comes to resources. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, they're, they're, they're short on agriculture. Rubber. No, short on timber. Short on oil. Uh, short on coal. Oh, no, they're generating coal. Really, really low on metal ore. That's probably what they were trying to buy from us. Really low on uranium. Electric power is good, though. Consumer goods are good, and industrial goods are good. I'm going to buy some industrial goods from them, actually. They want me to pay more, though. I don't like that. Who's the name of our leader, by the way? It's not going to tell me. Oh. Uh, yeah, you're both trying to sell me rubber at a... Not the best yeah, trades. We're not making that much money off of trades right now. Uh, yeah, I'll buy rubber from Kansas. And I'll buy rubber from Volgograd. That's it. Basically, we want to buy little, little bits of money here and there. Not too much. Um, I can... I'm going to decrease you back down to 300 again. Because this keeps popping up. Uh, lump sum consumer goods at 14. Yeah, I'll see. Lump sum, I will do that. That's no problem. And we have one thing done. So in 60 days or so. See, ru lump sum, rubber, yes. 60 days, rubber, no. No, I'm not doing times 60. This, these territories are not understanding what lump sum means. You're good to go as well. Which means you guys are all going to be good to go in 60 days. So in 60 days, we're going to have a massive spike in power usage. Um, so that might be a bit of a problem, actually. Problem is that our coal... We're building one coal place, right? Yeah, we are. Coal might be our primary... We'll see draw for power. Well, then again, we do also do hydro. Hydro should be really good for for us here. Like, there's Niagara Falls. Oh yeah. So our next big thing is we're gonna do a massive hydro power plant right here. Though hydro plants take forever to build, that's why I don't like them. Um. Construction complete. 63 days. Thomas Dagan, they're probably not going to use that much that much power, which is good, and I can sell them to then buy industrial goods and stuff. I'm more of a nuclear power plant kind of guy. More rubber, no thank you. We're $2 billion away from being able to pay off our first debt. Oh, there we go. We're half a billion away. Which reminds me, how are the construction going? 18 more days. There we go. We now have 135. Ooh, you want to sell? Okay, I'll buy that. 
But I'm also going to pay back one of our one of our bonds here. Boom. Uh, I'm going to say no to all that. And that's just going to go down temporarily while we pay off our debt. Remember, one of the main 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 things I want to do is pay off all this. This is really really chewing up our money right now. So we're paying twenty four million a year in interest. No, those are all really big uh, arrangements. Inflation's 2.9%. Now, our GDP has gone down by 2,000. That's only due to taxes and stuff. That's no big deal. We're not... We're not seeing um, deflation. So, inflation's still up there. It's right actually where it needs to be. Lump sum rubber. I'll take the lump sum rubber. Close it, those. One of the good things I like about playing a country like this, or a territory like this, I should say, because it's really not a country, it's a province, um... Is the, is the restrictions. It's really hard. Um, we don't have access to a lot of stuff, so we have to actually build our infrastructure. Um, we're basically going to harm the now for going long term. Uh, one of the plans I do hope to do is definitely expand west. I do want to go after these three provinces as fast as I can. But those will be in future episodes. Till then, see you next time. Bye-bye.